I'm David Sturgis, um, owner of uh, Ben River Holiday Accommodation. Um, we've been here 13 years. Uh, we own a, the boat hire business as well. We've got a little kiosk and we run it. My, my, myself, my wife and myself run the, the whole show, so yeah. It just, Ben River, I, like I say, I've been here 13 years and it just continues to produce. It, it doesn't stop producing. It's, a, it's an amazing inlet. Uh, it's a healthy system. Um, and the, the entrance opens periodically. Uh, this year it, it stayed open f virtually for 12 months, but which was really unusual. But it can open anything, open and close anything up to three or four times a year. Um, and then that depends entirely on rainfall. And we've got three major river that run into this system. And it just keeps it healthy. And it's a shallow inlet, so I think that helps flush it and cleans it. And, and the fish just seem to love it and so do the people. So, well, we're renowned for brim. Our black brim is, is, is our, um, we, we pride ourselves of having some, probably the best quality black brim in, in the district, you know, in, in the whole of Gippsland, and, and they call it the brim capital. We've also got any amount of flathead. Um, your bycatches here will be Taylor, Trevally, Salmon, Ludric. Uh, we've had some amazing runs of Ludric at different times when the entrances, they come in in huge schools. Uh, and then they'll disappear and they might be gone for a few years and then all of a sudden they'll be back. And, but, you know, the, the, our predominantly here is, is brim, but we also, there's a certain amount of people that target our uh, estuary perch. And we've got some classical estuary perch here as well. You know, we, we've got live bait you can get here. A lot of people now go on your soft plastics and your hard bodies. Your, your launching facility here could be better. Uh, and, and we're working at the moment with uh, different... Um, like the East Kitsland Shire and that, and they are promising to build a new boat ramp, which is better than what we got. Uh, we also have, when the water's up, we also have the other little jetty, the Fingling Jetty, and that uh, and that's quite good to put boats in and out of as well. We've got a great area for the guys in their kayaks that come down. You know, they, they've got a great spot off the banks of Ludrick Park. Um, you, we haven't got any launching facilities in the river and that'd be really really good if we eventually end up with something that yep. we can drop boats in off the bank there is a lot of talk about that but i think we will get more fishing platforms and than launching facilities in the future well, what, the tournament we want to run it's it's not it's a, it's a free a free competition that we want to run to promote our town for our winter our winter goes very very quiet here and there's you know there's quite a number of there's seven or eight businesses that thrive and uh, that live out of this community and we just want to make it a little bit better because winter fishing here can be really, really good and I don't think a lot of people realise that. What it is, we're going to tag some fish. We haven't quite made up our mind how many that will be. It'll probably be up to 10. And uh, our idea is to um, uh, get everyone to put their name down. They don't have to pay a fee. We just need a registration form. And, and, and it doesn't matter where they come. They can be land-based. They can be boat fishing. Uh, off the jetties, whatever. If they ha hook one of those fish, they're a winner. That's how it's going to be. We're going to run this for three months over winter and it'll be open to anyone and everyone that comes to Ben River and fishes our, our waterways. And, you know, some of the, some of the prizes is going to shock a lot of people. Every, every, everyone in the town will be involved um, and any of the websites will have an up-to-date of what's going on. Um, our East Gippsland papers, you know, fish, um, fishing monthly, obviously, um, and you know we've, we're also working on one of our local radio stations, who happens to be one of the owners, happens to have a house here in in Pim River, so hopefully he'll come on board and we'll we'll get a bit of good PA out of that.